We going to sneak around to look through the Empress's unmentionables now? Just how drunk are you, boss? I'm hurt. No one's supposed to be here. Briala said... Oh, I shouldn't have trusted her. Briala told you to come to this wing of the palace? Not personally. The ambassador can't be seen talking to the servants. We get coded messages at certain locations, but the order came from her. She's been watching the Grand Duke all night. No surprise she wanted someone to search his sister's room. Is there anyone else who knows the code in the drop location who could have written those orders? I... I don't know. Any of us could do it, but... No. No one else would send me here. It had to be Briala. What were you trying to find in Florian's old room? The message didn't say. I should have known it was a setup. So this room belongs to Grand Duchess Florian. It used to. This had been her private room in Halam Shiral since she was a child. But this part of the palace was damaged, and the royal family moved to the guest wing. This wing is sealed. How did you get in here? Easy. The door was unlocked. One of the others probably handled it. It takes great courage to come to the royal wing unarmed. It's not courage to blindly follow Briala's orders into a trap. I knew her. Before. When she was Celine's pet. Now she wants to play revolution. But I remember. She was sleeping with the Empress who purged our alienage. Would you be willing to testify to that, if I asked? Absolutely. If the Inquisition will protect me, I'll tell you everything I know about our ambassador. Go to the ballroom. Find Commander Cullen. He'll keep you safe. Thank you. Make her protect you, Inquisitor.
happened here? You painted on lazy and assholes! When I get out of this... Inquisitor, what a pleasure. I wasn't certain you'd attend. You're such a challenge to read. I had no idea if you'd taken my bait. I had a feeling you were mixed up in all this. Such a pity. You could almost be our legion, if you were just a little quicker. It was kind of you to walk into my trap so willingly. I was so tired of your meddling. Corypheus insisted that the Empress die tonight, and I would hate to disappoint him. Why kill the Empress? What does Corypheus want to achieve? Selene's death is a stepping stone on the path to a better world. Corypheus will enter the Black City and claim the godhood waiting for him. We will cast down your useless maker and usher in a united world, guided by the hand of an attentive god. Your Orlesian royalty. Why would you help Corypheus attack your empire? You think so small, Inquisitor. Why settle for an empire when Corypheus will remake the entire world? I admit, I will relish the look on Gaspar's face when he realizes I've outplayed him. He always was a sore loser. What exactly is in this for you? <laughs> the world, of course. I'll deliver the entire south of Thedas, and Corypheus will save me. When he has ascended to godhood, I will rule all Thedas in his name. You don't have to go through with this, Florian. There's still time to turn back. Oh, my dear Inquisitor, you are so naive. In their darkest dreams, no one imagines I would assassinate Selene myself. All I need is to keep you out of the ballroom long enough to strike. A pity you'll miss the rest of the ball, Inquisitor. They'll be talking of it for years. Kill him, and bring me his marked hand. It will make a fine gift for the master. all that? Were those demons? There aren't any more of those blasted demons coming, right? No more demons. It's safe. Maker? I've never seen one that close before. I knew Gaspard was a bastard, but I didn't think he'd feed me the fucking horrors over a damn bill. Duke Gaspard lured you out here? Well, his sister. But it had to come from him, didn't it? But all that garbage she was spewing doesn't mean anything. Gaspard had to be the mastermind. Your accent sounds Ferelden. I thought you were one of Gaspard's mercenaries. Born and raised in Denerim. Seems like I should have stayed there. The Duke wanted to move on the palace tonight. But he didn't have enough fancy chevaliers. So he hired me and my men. 
He had to offer us triple our usual pay to come to Orle. Stinking, punchy cheesemonger. He's going to attack tonight. What about the peace talks? Nobles don't give a shit about honor and conduct unless it suits them. He'll do what it takes to claim the throne. Impressively ruthless of Gaspard, if predictable. Do these people ever not stab each other in the back? Just curious. Gaspard's methods are thuggish. You saved my life. I owe you. And Gaspard still hasn't paid me. You want me to talk to the Empress, or the court, or sing a blasted song in the Chantry? I'll do it. Maker, you're back. The Empress will begin her speech soon. What should we do? The Grand Duchess is the assassin. Don't let her anywhere near the Empress. Duchess? At once, Inquisitor. Let all gathered attend. Her Imperial Majesty will now address the court. Lords and ladies, as a nation, we mourn our sons and daughters, brothers and sisters, friends and lovers claimed by war. The sky is torn open, our divine is dead, and many fear the end of all things comes upon us. Orle must stand as a bastion, a bulwark behind which all Fidas may take shelter. So has it stood for a thousand years. So shall it ever stand. This would not have been possible without the efforts of many. Dear cousin, please step forward. Grand Duchess, stand down! Now! Kill them all! Colin, protect the people! Yes, Inquisitor! 
Beaten at every turn. You've taken the moment of my victory and left me in disgrace. And now you've chased a defenseless woman into the garden. Are you proud of yourself? We have the palace. Surrender, Your Grace. You don't have to die today. <laughs> Surrender? Now? Oh, you poor deluded thing. The night is still young. All I need to recover is to kill you, Inquisitor. So good of you to attend my soiree.
Your sister attempted regicide in front of the entire court, Gaspard. You're the spy master. If anyone knew this atrocity was coming, it was you. You don't deny your involvement. I do deny it. I knew nothing of Florian's plans. But you... You knew it all and did nothing. <laughs> I don't know which is better. That you think I'm all-seeing? Or that you're trying so hard to play innocent? And failing? Enough! We will not bicker while De Winter plots against our nation. For the safety of the Empire, I will have answers. I wouldn't have caught Florian in time without Briala's help. You were working together? Of course. Gaspard's been trying to bully the Council of Heralds into crowning him Emperor. I met a Council attaché who can confirm it. A few idle threats hardly make me a traitor. Keep talking, Gaspard. Eventually you'll convince somebody. He also murdered a Council of Heralds emissary. I found the body and his knife in the servants' quarters. I have done no such thing. And his mercenary captain will be happy to tell you all their plans for the coup tonight. Briala found all of this out for your sake, Selim. In light of overwhelming evidence, we have no choice but to declare you an enemy of the Empire. You are hereby sentenced to death. The Empress has spoken. Long live the Emperor. Thank you, Inquisitor, for all your efforts tonight. I owe you my life, and Orlé owes you its future. You have done a service for the Empire never to be forgotten, my friend. This piece is your doing. You truly are the instrument of Andraste. Orle will never forget your part in this. Nor will I. Lords and ladies of the court, the civil war which has plagued us is at an end. The Orlesian Empire is whole again. Those who drove us into war for selfish gain have been dealt with as traitors. Gaspard de Chalon is guilty of treason. He is no longer our cousin and shall never again hold title or land in Orlé. We have lost enough. No more! Now, we can move forward to healing and restoration. In our hour of need, the Inquisition has faced these dangers beside us. It is the honor of Orlé to stand with Andraste's herald to end this crisis. And in ages to come, our children and grandchildren can say that we left them a brighter world. Will you address the court, my friend? Our enemy is clever. He manipulated the highest ranking members of the court. If we want victory, we will have to fight him in more ways than one. We of the court must use our resources. Not every battle is won on the field. But that is tomorrow. Tonight, feast, my friends. Enjoy our victory. There will be many more to come. The Orlesian nobility make drunken toasts to your victory, and yet you are not present to hear them. Do you tire so quickly of their congratulations, Inquisitor? It is most fickle, after all your efforts on their behalf. Everyone suddenly wants to talk to me. You, at least, I'm glad to see. <laughs> then I have happy news as you shall be seeing a great deal more of me.
By imperial decree, I have been named liaison to the Inquisition. Celine wishes to offer you any and all aid, including mine. Congratulations. Welcome to the Inquisition, Morrigan. A most gracious response. I shall meet you at Skyhold. Is everything all right? You look troubled. I'm just worn out. The night has been... very long. It was a tumultuous evening, but... Orle is safe now. It was worth the struggle. Is there anything I can do? Um, can I get you anything? A drink, perhaps? Would you care to dance with me, Lady Josephine? I was hoping you'd ask, my lord. The matter is urgent, Lady Josephine. I am well aware of that, revered mother. We will need them to return to Valroyo as soon as possible. There are ceremonies, ordinations, maker's mercy. That's quite impossible at the moment. However, I will see to this matter as soon as possible. My Lord Inquisitor. Please, may I have a word with you? How may I assist you, revered mother? With the political turmoil put to rest, our minds turn to a single question. The next divine. We cannot answer it without the left and right hands of divine Justinia V. I have already told you, revered mother. Lady Leliana and Sikar Cassandra cannot be spared from their duties. But surely with the support of the Empire, the Inquisition will not be harmed by the loss of just two souls. Liliana and Cassandra would have to make that decision for themselves. And they certainly will, at a later date. The Inquisitor has only just returned and has important business to attend to. You must excuse us, revered mother. Don't let them detract from your victory at Alam Shiral. The support of the Empire should make our search for the Grey Wardens easier. Varric is eager to help his friend Hawk. <laughs> 